Welcome to Cook, Serve, Delicious 2 and my continuing attempts to do all the Chef for Her events, add all the restaurants and get a medal each time. Preferably gold. I'm currently having a little blast through sushi nests. Sushi nest even, so I'll continue doing that. Last time around I got a silver in shift number 5. This time around I'm doing shift number 6 which has sushi, egg drop soup and ramen noodles with rice as a side, soda and tea as the drink, 65% bars and 8 serving stations. I'm not good at sushi nest as is proved by the silver medal in shift number 5. However, I'm just in the mood to do sushi nest so that is what I'm doing. Yes, I'm strange that way. I'm strange in lots of ways, but what can I say? Sometimes I just feel like doing a restaurant, and today it's Lucky Sushi Ness's turn to have caught my attention and, and desire to deal with it. Okay, I need to do some more sushi. As you may or may not have noticed, I'm not particularly fast at sushi. Apparently I'm doing a lot of ramen noodles, however. I seem to be getting a lot of requests for ramen noodles. Okay, time to prepare some more everything. Well, I would if it gave me a chance. However, it doesn't seem to want to give me a chance right now. I got that wrong. That's not going to be helpful. shower yet every single slot was filled up.
six. Ram and oil cook at the same time. This is not going to go well. Okay, that was hard work. Yes, I know it's still going on, but I'm just giving the warning number three a little chance to cook before I start the warning number four. Sorry, in warning number one. Yikes, that was definitely a lot of key presses. Have I made a mistake so far? I know I got very close to one at one point. Doesn't mean I won't make a mistake on the last two orders, if I haven't made one already. Oh no, I didn't make a mistake! Oh, that's nice! That's a perfect day, and a gold medal! 268 bronze medals, as it says, unlocked. Well, 268 medals in total out of a possible 400. And I unlocked Lips Art Abstract. Okay. Uh, table necessities, a bucket of peanuts. Table decor, okay. Waterfalling, art places. I unlocked a bit of art and a bucket of peanuts. And that was shift number six. Oh yeah, shift number seven. That should be fun. But we'll see how that goes in the future. Okay, and one email I got is Man, another patch for Blade of Bone. Seriously, I heard they just released another patch that apparently improves frame rate by 26% and fixes all those bugs and stuff. Lazy devs, this should have been done in the game at launch to begin with. They're not getting any of my money, that's for sure. A beverage. <laughs> A beverage? Okay, extension 7800. And yes, with games, as with all software, it depends on the it's not the developers that are normally the problem it's the business the expected release date the marketing and the financial people that push for software to be shipped out before it's as ready as developers want to make it and sometimes it's because between the, those people and the developers there's management with no backbone who have let themselves be bullied into a release date and then this artificial release date they don't want to give the bad news that they can't meet that artificial release date so they'll ship out a buggy product rather than miss the release date and make themselves look bad so don't blame the developers for bad software because the developers don't normally want to ship bad software it's normally an artificial release date that forces them into it. 
forced on them by people who don't know what they're doing, don't have a backbone or to have a vested interest in meeting a release date for no apparently good reason that a developer can understand. <coughs> Excuse me. So there endeth the lesson about software development. Anyway, I will shut up now, and as always, I hope you enjoyed, and hopefully I will see you down the road for more Chef for Hire... Chef for Hire events and cook, serve delicious too. And I'm going to have a coughing fit, so I'll shut up now and say cheerio.